Cheryl, this was a party, or I should say is a party, because it's still going on. Fit for a king, perhaps better though, fit for a billionaire entrepreneur and businessman, J.B. Pritzker, footing the bill for all of this with thousands of people invited. And the governor of the state of Illinois, J.B. Pritzker. J.B. Pritzker and First Lady M.K. Pritzker welcomed everyone to the celebration and christened the inaugural ball with the first dance tonight, a lavish party to usher in a new day. I think it's very well put together. I'm sure J.B., who does everything first class, is going to have a wonderful evening for all of us. The big entertainment secret finally revealed when Maroon 5 took the stage after the first dance, wowing the crowd and only ramping up the festivities. This is amazing. It is for the people. All the proceeds are being donated to charity from what I understand. So we are all here just to have a great time. One of the charities will be the Illinois State Fair Foundation. The other, Cabrini Green Legal Aid, which helps low-income Chicagoans maneuver the legal system. The executive director, a colleague of Lieutenant Governor Juliana Stratton. Being the recipient of this award was quite a surprise. Um, Juliana called me during the week at like 10 o'clock at night and gave us the big news. And so I was halfway asleep like, what is going on? Um, this is so exciting. For those who have been to other inaugural balls, Pritzker's may be the best. This is the fourth one. They're all swanky and elegant, but I would say that by, so far this one's by far the most swanky and the most elegant. Party is still going on. The crowd is still packed in there. Tickets were 250 bucks a piece to get in with open bar and all the food you could eat. With at least a thousand people here, that means they've raised a quarter of a million dollars for those charities. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.